Hi everyone, thank you for joining me here today at Fluid Arts by Elsa. And we're gonna get quickly started on this piece. It is gonna be a 24 by 30 inch canvas, which I already have prepped here. Okay, so the larger canvas, I kinda like the space that the larger canvas gives you to work and create designs. So I'm gonna be working with a lot of the pastel colors um, since we have the Easter time upon us. Um, let's get started. Meet me at the canvas. Okay, so here we are. Thank you for joining me. So I already have my canvas prepped, my colors selected, and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get started here. So first, I think I'm gonna do the same design that I did in the triptych from my previous video, but this time I'm gonna do it on one canvas. So then be like a circle here, a um, uh, half circle here, and then a different color down the middle. Now, the colors I'm gonna be using today, let me just look for my milky white. Okay, so I'm gonna be using Master's Touch milky white as my base color and i'm also going to be using this leftover paint here which is light phthalo green by golden so look how beautiful colors are still fresh okay see and that's my consistency for my paint and the same for my milky white from uh, master's touch have a tub mixed here. So you can take a look. See? Okay. And again, I'm just gonna start making my borders to separate the colors. Be a little more, but I'll fix it. Uh, same over here. Just like that. Okay. Same over here. We're good. Okay. Um, I'm trying to see if that's enough. I think so. Okay. All right, and then I'm gonna do the same thing with the milky white on the other side so the colors don't move on me. Okay, and I'm gonna go right here. Just like that. like that. Perfect. Okay. I love these colors together. It looks beautiful. It, it's spring. It, it sings. <laughs> um, I'll take some more of this blue. Just gonna see here. Right in there, and right in here, okay. Okay, awesome. And now quickly, uh, let me get moving. So 
this color goes on the edge and over here. And on this edge, there. Okay. Quickly with my spreader. And I got these spreaders are Michaels, and I feel that they help me so much more to put my paint down on the canvas. So I will continue to use them. And then I'll spread it out with my hair dryer just to get my sides covered. But for now, this is working marvelously, and I will continue to use it until I find something else. I love the colors. Today are Ultramarine Violet B Light. So, Ultramarine Violet Light by Amsterdam. if I do one in the middle. Let me see how it turns out. And then I am going to be using Iridescent Orange Yellow by Pebel. Love the colors. Next, I have Venice Yellow by Pebble. So, Venice Yellow by Pebble. Next, I have Iridescent Blue Green by Pebble. Next, I have Naples Yellow Red by Amsterdam. It looks a lot like the milky white. I am adding a smidge of 24 karat gold by Deco Art. And lastly, I am using Pearl Lime Green by Arteza. I'm thinking I should have done this be up that way. Or this be down this way? No. Okay. Let's 
Tours, Connors, get these bubbles out. Love the colors, but I think I might just need the wispy in there and the wispy out here. And I'm gonna do that real quick. Only because I don't want to have all that negative space. So out that way, out that way. Okay. Real quick. That way, that way. I just didn't want to have too much negative space. A little negative space is good, but I don't want all that negative space. ready here okay and last but not least the pearl lime green right there okay and we're gonna torch this once again all right now how are we going to blow this out what I'm thinking, okay, so I'm going to blow out that way first. Gorgeous. Absolutely love it. Uh, going right here. I don't know. I don't want it to mess up my design. Okay, nothing there. Okay. Good. What do I want to do here? Just 
that's good. I don't want to touch anything. Um, I don't want to touch anything else. I'm going to come around and I'm going to fix right over here. But other than that, I think it looks gorgeous. I'm going to bring this in. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. I don't think there's anything else I'm going to do here. I'm going to torch it a little bit and I'm going to bring you guys down for a close up because this is stunning. Okay, I'm gonna fix my edges and I'm gonna bring you for a close up. Now, here is the piece the painting check out how gorgeous this is so soft it's beautiful look at these colors look at the cells the splash of colors look at those cells beautiful gorgeous okay, look at that those the petals look beautiful it screams Easter. All the pastel colors together. Branching out. Take a look at that webbing. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I am so happy with this color palette. Got those cells there. They look like they're disconnected, but they're part of that petal. Beautiful. Look at them. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Look at those colors there, beautiful. I love it. What you think? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click on the notification bell. That way you're notified anytime I have new video posted. I will show you once this gets a top coat of resin. It is absolutely beautiful. 
Thank you for joining me here at Fluid Arts by Elsa. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.